Hi guys, my name is Shargio and today I'll be answering some of your frequently asked questions. Today we'll be going over how to update your Biopods firmware using an iOS device. Before updating your Biopods firmware, please ensure that you have the latest version of the Biopod app. If you're not sure if you have the latest version, you can go into your app store, click on the update section, and check your update history to see the latest apps that have been updated. If your Biopod app isn't showing up in the update screen, the best way to be sure that you have the latest Biopod version is to uninstall the Biopod app and reinstall it. Once you're sure that you have the latest version of the Biopod app, go ahead and open it. In the Biopod dashboard, on the top right, click on the hamburger menu. Then click on settings, click on update biopod. So now we're at the update biopod screen. For those of you who are setting up your biopod for the very first time, you will come across the screen in the initial Wi-Fi setup wizard. Please make sure you read the instructions very thoroughly. During this process, please do not unplug your biopod as this can cause irreversible damage. So now that you're ready to go, go ahead and press next. At this step, you have to reset your biopod. If you're still unsure about how to reset your biopod, please click the link in the description below. Once you reset your biopod, go ahead and press next. At this step, you have to connect your iOS device's Wi-Fi to your Biopod's Wi-Fi. So go ahead and go back to the main menu, then click on Settings. In Settings, go to Wi-Fi and look for the Biopod Wi-Fi here. If you get asked for a password, the password is always Biopod123, all lowercase. Now, go back into the app. Now wait for the app to recognize the connection. Now you'll see a message saying congratulations that your Wi-Fi has been connected to your Biopod. Hit next to continue. At this step, the app asks you to confirm your upgrade process. So go ahead and press update. After the firmware has been uploaded and updated, you'll receive a message confirming. At this step, we recommend waiting up to five minutes for the upgrade process to be completed. Once five minutes have passed, Go ahead and click End. Once you've completed the Biopod firmware update, you'll come across this screen. Now we can connect the Biopod to your home Wi-Fi. So when you're ready, go ahead and press Next. At this step, we have to connect the app to your local Wi-Fi. So go ahead and press Next. The app will be checking for your Wi-Fi connections. Now whatever your Wi-Fi is, all you have to do is go into the password and enter your password. Once you've entered your home Wi-Fi password, go ahead and press OK. Then hit Next. At this step, we have to redirect the Biopod app to the Biopod's Wi-Fi. So go ahead and go back to the main menu, click Settings, and now find the Biopod Wi-Fi in your Wi-Fi settings. Connect to it, go back into the main menu, and open up the Biopod app again. Give it a few seconds to detect the Wi-Fi. Once you see the big congratulations, this means that your Biopod has been successfully connected to your home Wi-Fi. So go ahead and hit next. Once you've reached this step, you have to confirm your Wi-Fi connection by entering your Biopod's full serial number. You can find the serial number at the back of your Biopod. Once the connection has been confirmed, go ahead and hit end. Congratulations, your Biopod has been fully updated. If you're still stuck and are unsure how to update your Biopod's firmware, please go onto our website onto the support section drop-down menu. Click on technical guides and you'll see an option there for the Biopod firmware update guide.